guys so yeah it has been way too long it has been a long time since you've seen a video from me unfortunately this isn't even the update video we still got a little bit of work left to do but it has been a long time and i wanted to update you guys give you you know irl video so you can see my face and you know it's just so it's more personal when when i tell you that <laughs> everything's gone to shit and uh and uh you know we, you know, we got to work on things but uh, uh before we get into the server stuff i'll just talk a little bit about me doing good Still sticking with plan, um, random ass video on my phone playing. Not much to talk about, really. Um, this month has been a little tough, as you can imagine, from the lack of videos, lack of updates, lack of seeing me in game. Uh, and sort of earlier in the, the month, I uh, was sort of slowing down, getting a little depressed. Uh, you know, not necessarily, I didn't give up, I still, you know, worked out every single day, but it was getting harder. And then the uh, cyberpunk anime came out, and that was really cool. So ever since then, I, you know, I, I, was, I was able to evade the depression for, for now. I, I only was only there for about two weeks or so. Um, and luckily, uh, that, didn't, that didn't last longer, because that's usually what, you know, what derails any any attempt I've ever had of, you know, trying to better myself is depression, right? You get depressed and then give up on everything. It's really easy to do that. And if you're, if you're, you know, if you're familiar with depression, then you already know. But if not, it's essentially just one day you wake up and nothing matters anymore. You don't want to be alive. You don't want to do your hobbies. You don't want to eat. You don't want, I mean, you kind of, there's two ways. You either don't want to eat or you want to eat everything. There's, there's really no in between. Uh, I'm the, I, I was the eat everything kind of guy, but... <laughs> But, um, yeah, so, I mean, it, it was struggling for a little while there, and then I got sick um, the last couple days. I'm still sick right now, but it's not too bad, just kind of a runny nose, but it's it's going away, so I should be good soon. But, uh, yeah, so it's just been slow, it's been slow, and then in terms of uh, Revival itself, we'll talk about that. The, um, this was always sort of something we knew was going to happen, that the player count would sort of dip or decline, because I understand you guys, I understand what the problem is, there's no end game content, you guys are bored. All the people we had playing the server were are, are bored. You've, you've done everything there is to do, except for the things you don't want to do, and we'll talk about that in a sec. But um, So I understand you, I understand that, but the, the, thing, the reason why we had to do what we had to do, the reason we had to do that was because we... Yeah, it's it's a lot harder to advertise. It's as simple as that. The advertisements, um, it's been it's been a harder process. My favorite YouTuber that I've ever worked with uh, ripped us off this time around. We paid him. We paid him in May, uh, two hundred two hundred seventy five dollars for a video, and it is now October and still have not gotten the video. Nor will we ever get the video. So, um, and then a lot of people just won't reply back. Uh, we've been working with a couple people, but we've noticed that, um, like recently, we, we, we had a couple videos from Arts, and Arts is a pretty good YouTuber, pretty big YouTuber, we've worked with them in the past, and uh, we've, you know, they worked, the videos would, would get attention, if you looked in the Discord, you'd see a lot of new people checking it out, and you'd see some random faces log in, but almost every single player had the exact same reaction, oh, this server sucks, the home location is awful, and they would immediately log out, before you could even really reply back to them, so... Uh, we just were not attracting new players. All of the advertisements we were getting were wasted, and um, all of the you know the current players we had were were starting to get to that point where they finished the game. So it was um, we just had, we had to do something. We had to change the home location, and that was uh, one of the last updates that you saw. And then another big part of that was the training zone. The training zone doesn't necessarily have to be tr um, changed. I guess the old one could have just been improved a little bit. No one's really going to try to... I, I'm, I'm expecting no, no one to really use this that much anyways, but part of the goal, and oh, this thing should not be aggressive. Did I attack it at some point, or is it just being a dick? Anyways, uh, so the, the, the goal is to make this an actual zone that you'll actually use. So I, I'm expecting there to be some a lot of people here, and uh, I, I'll go into it in a little bit. So, I mean, you're, you're, I might as well show you what you're, what you're about to get, right? So this is Kodak. you got little mini bears. Um, so Kodak is a group boss. Everybody who does damage to it will get loot. And the caveat for the Kodak is that, once we kill this nerd, is uh, he has a really long respawn timer. So uh, this is, you basically, everybody will, you know, start piling on him once he spawns, and then go back to your mini bears and chill. It is multi, but hopefully that doesn't, like, cause too many problems you can't put cannons here so there's none of that and hopefully we won't have too many people trying to like i don't know chain or barrage but you never know this is this is supposed to be a really good spot for group ironman like this is an amazing spot for group ironman train together when they first start out the server they can oh ooh, group, group, group chest why did that not yell or did they yell oh yeah they did yell cool if you're wondering why i got so many loots it's because p ring gives you uh it gives you i think five loots maybe is that five i don't know it doesn't look like five. It looks like a four. Why would I get four? I, I, I don't know. Doesn't matter. <laughs> it doesn't matter. 
So that's uh, the, the, the logic of that. Also does have a little pet, which I'm still kind of fucking around with. The amount of time I've spent trying to get this thing looking good, like the, like the the thing looks fine. It just looks like a little version of the bear. I mean, it looks like it's supposed to. The inventory icon, I just could not get it working. It was a struggle, and I probably spent like three, four hours on that alone. And was it worth it? No, I accomplished nothing. Honestly, I mean, it looks worse than when I started. I was just trying to get the bear to like go the other direction, to like face that way. So, but it, it, yeah, it didn't work out. But it's a pet. To, uh, I'm not gonna. I'm not this. I'm not gonna scrap it. It's just gonna be dumb. Uh, if you get the little bear, you get a little bear. Got these little spiders here. Not gonna show the loots, but they do have good loots. As you can kind of see some weird stuff from the the couple kills we got there. And then they will also drop elven gold. Uh, so the elven gold shop. I'm still gonna add some more stuff to this. I'm just trying to think of like some I, I'm, I'm gonna add more like supply type stuff like stuff that i think like new players would, would want to buy and would actually want to buy i'm not really trying to make it so that like old returning players have to come do this content but i, I you know it, it hopefully it will be interesting content once you see what the the kodak drops I'm, i imagine there will be some people here just killing it for a little while farming the bears or something We've got glass spiders over here too Another thing that was in the updated, this was requested, was I renamed all the guards. Uh, well, not all of them, but just the ones that are the most important. So they have uh, specific names. So these are now Elven Guards. The ones in Falador are called Falador Guards, and the ones in Rock are called Rock Guards. So it's just a little easier to search up your specific guard. Um, I mean, that's a very minor thing, but it's just one of those things that we can improve on. So I still got some things we've got to change to this, and there's still some other improvements and other quality of life stuff that's going to get added to the update. As far as when, I have no clue. If you're seeing this video, it's probably not good, but uh, trying, trying to get there. Um, this is the last thing we have to do that will hopefully appease new players. I think the home location is a lot better. It's a lot more new player friendly. We really haven't had a lot of new players lately, so it's kind of hard to tell. We've, we've got to you know pick things up, but dark has been making progress on the data okay so uh, here's uh, he's got next uh, right there next work and we got uh, uh, nightmare so we have a lot of that stuff uh, around the corner the plan is now that this is all sorted the new players are hopefully sorted we are going to I, I personally am going to be working on the Halloween event that is the next best thing I can I can promise you guys the Halloween event is gonna be overpowered to make up for the fact that September kind of sucked as a month we didn't really do a lot not a lot of updates you didn't see me a lot so I apologize for that but October Halloween event is going to be really really good and then sometimes sometime either later this month or at the beginning of November God Wars 2 is going to be out and then you're going to, um, Dark is going to, um, work on Theater of Blood, that is the first thing he's going to do, and then I believe next, maybe Nightmare, but I think it was next. So you're going to start getting a lot of that in-game content. Uh, so I have one quick question for you guys. How do you guys feel about raid boxes? Raid boxes was something we had on Revival 1, and originally when this server came out, I was 100% against the idea, and I told people we would never have them. But I've sort of kind of changed my opinion, I feel like, um... And, and I've seen some, you know, I've, I really, really not so much my opinion. It's that I've seen what the players' opinions seem to change, right? Uh, it seems like a, lo a lot of people just don't want to do raids. It's considered group content. Uh, and no one really wants to solo it. It's, it's very difficult to solo it. And um, there's not a whole lot of people that want to do it together as a group either. I, I only know of a handful of people that have ever even done raids. I personally have no plans of ever doing it. I just immediately, like, I, I, don't, I don't like it. I don't like Chamber of Zeus, Eric. I, I have no plans of doing it. So... I, but I also don't want to like immediately devalue all of that stuff. But there, there could definitely be ways to improve it. I mean, like, so the biggest problem with raids is so it takes about 40, 50 minutes or so. It's a, it's a commitment, and you're, you're either gonna have to contribute, which is a lot of effort, or you're leeching. Which I mean, if you're leeching, someone else is contributing. So no matter what, someone's got to contribute. And you get to the end, and you get 400 Avantos and a Dark Relic. It's like it's just not worth it, right? But if every single raid you're getting raid points and then you can buy a raid bot like so like i don't know let's just say let's say you let's say you're your bank right you're, you're somebody who's actually going to lead the raid and do good i don't know maybe it's five raids five raids basically guarantees you a raid item and raid points we can also put them in group loot chests so that there's a lot more motivation to do any group loot activities uh i i don't know it's one of those things where at first it just made no sense to do but as we've progressed through the server it's starting to think like a lot of that content is is, is going to be inaccessible for a very long time if we never get you know if we never have a huge server where people are raiding all the time which you know i don't know if that's going to happen i, I obviously i want that to happen but uh you know we, we're going to have to make some changes if it doesn't happen but anyways thanks for watching hope you guys enjoyed i apologize again for the lack of stuff that you know that, that didn't happen in september hopefully we can make up to you guys next month 
you have any ideas, any suggestions, any responses to you know what I had to talk about, then I would love to hear from you guys. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you soon.